What is your brand? Do you want to provide the cheapest services and get any and everybody in there and just have clientele all over the all over the place? Or do you want to get in that the, the, the client or the patient that understands that this is a journey? It, you you uh, work by a treatment plan. You understand the average price of these treatments and it's not a negotiating battle whenever they walk through the door. Um, I think all that matters. Typically, that weeds out those that are just bargain shopping for how much is this syringe? And let me call down the street and see how much this syringe is. Newsflash, syringes don't put themselves in. It is the provider that puts the syringe in. So good luck. It always ends up being more expensive than in the long run to fix these problems that could potentially happen. Or you're going to places that don't even have a Holonex, any reversal. Or it's just like the, the stories that I see in here. It's just crazy. So that is likely, I know for sure that's not the clientele that I want to attract. I want someone that actually understands that they're seeing an actual medical professional that if something goes wrong, you know, nobody ever hopes for anything to go wrong, but let's face it, it can. So what are you going to do at that point in time? And are you going to trust and follow the plan that this provider it has put in place in order to get you the most optimal outcome? So that 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 choice of clientele or patient could literally make or break you because doing everything the cheap route is not sustainable, if you ask me. I totally agree. And also, I think it's really hard to deliver high quality results to people that are trying to nickel and dime you about, you know, the smallest treatment and, the, you know, trying to get the, the, the cheapest thing. And it's like, well... You get the cheapest thing, but, you know, it's like it's not going to, you know, you could have a much better result with just a little bit more investment. And, you know, so it's really hard to deliver high quality. Absolutely. Because, you know, we we spoke about, um, you know, type of services and doing the um, full facial versus letting the patient come in and, and show you that they want this one thing done. To your point, if they just get this one thing done, they're still going to be very underwhelmed because, they want, remember, they bring in the, the filter photo. They want all of that with one syringe. And if you don't understand, you know, yourself that you cannot achieve that with one or two or probably even three syringes, this patient is going to, in their mind, you don't know what you're doing. You know, that's the first thing that they're going to think when it's really a lack of education for the provider and you have to educate the patient you know this is not they're not the expert at this you have to redirect those conversations